Hello everyone, my name is John English IV. I am the host and creator of Bow Ties and Button Ups. The name Bow Ties and Button Ups came from me just being a, a modern classic man in today's society. So I found out that as I got older, I began to change the way I dressed. So with that, adding that bow tie was something that just came from nowhere. I'll give you a story about that in just a moment. But the name uh, Bow Ties and Button Ups is just to signify the classiness of the modern man. Um, you know, when you think about bow ties, you think about a little modern thing other than a regular tie. The bow tie itself can be used in so many different ways. You can dress it up or you can dress it down. So being that I am this modern man and being able to do a little bit of all of it, I figured it would work very well with the name bow ties and button ups. Let's get into actually tying a bow tie, which is something that a lot of people ask me about because the majority of the people that I know, they have the little clip-ons and you know go about their business and it looks very good. But tying a bow tie is a little bit harder than it looks. So I'm going to show you guys that in just a moment. Okay, so let's get to it. Let's go ahead and start the process of um, tying this bow tie and you guys can see how easy it is to get around that neck and look like a classic man. So here we go. All right, we'll clip this on right here. Trying to do this with this uh, iPad is kind of simple. Bam! You just tied your bow tie. I'm out, y'all. Deuces. Okay, okay, okay. That wasn't. That actually was was not how you tie a bow tie. That's how you put on a um, already pre-made tie. So let's go ahead and really get down to the nuts and bolts of the video so that way I can show you guys how to actually do this. Um, it's very frustrating. Your arms are going to be like mine by the time you're done. You see that? Um, it's very strong and very big. And mainly because of the fact that these things are tough to put on. They're annoying. All right. So what you want to do is um, you want to make sure that you go on there and you get the right neck size for your neck. Very important that you have that already done so that way it kind of helps you along and you're not strangling yourself and or having too much give. So what you want to do is just like any, like the regular tie, you want to make sure you have one side that's shorter and one side that's longer. It doesn't matter which side it is, um, I'm comfortable having mine like, like this. So you want to make sure that you have one side longer than the other. From here, what you're going to do is you are going to cross. You're going to cross it. Overlap the longer side with the shorter side. See how I did that? Overlap that. You're then going to take this and go underneath. You're gonna go underneath it, underneath. So I'm gonna go underneath and then loop it through the neck. And you're going to pull this and I always kind of toss mine back. So I have that. So now that you have that, you have this little piece in the middle here. You wanna take this middle piece and fold it over. So you're gonna take it and fold it over just like that. So again, I'm gonna show you. you. Take this, fold it, just like this. So it kinda of looks like a bow tie already, right? So now that you have this done, you're going to take the longer piece and pull it over the top. So you're gonna take it from here, you toss it over, pull this over the top right in the middle. So you see how it's in the middle there and it's hanging right in the front. So you can see that it's hanging right in the front there. Then what I'm going to do is I'm going to take the, the flaps, my bows, and pull them together and hold them there. So again, I'm going to take these, you're going to pull them and hold them together. The next thing you're going to do is take this piece here. Oh, by the way, there is a hole that's created once you do that. There's a hole right there. Put my finger through it. Put my finger right through that. Looks very nasty, but you know, you get the visual. So the hole is there. So I'm gonna take this other piece. I'm only gonna put this halfway through. So I'm gonna take it and feed the whole thing through, but only half of it. So you, you know that it's half of it because of the way it's shaped. 
So you're going to go to half of it and pull it through. So now you can see it from this side. So now I'm going to take this other piece and bring the two together, right? I brought the two together. This piece now, it's kind of lonely. So we need to kind of merge these two together. So what you're going to do now is you're going to take this piece and you're going to pull this through. And you're going to hold these two together. So you're going to hold this together and pull this through. So that's way it tightens up in the middle. From there, you're going to have your other side of the bow. So now, you're going to take it and you're going to put them together. And fix them however you need to make it look nice. All right, you're now going to go in here, and put the collar down. And just like that, your bow tie is tied. So I made the hood look very easy. It's actually a lot harder, harder than it is. Um, the story behind me and my bow ties was when I first started at the bank, I was gifted some bow ties. And my wife, it was just sitting there for years, years. My sister actually bought some more after my birthday and said, hey, you like bow ties? She ended up buying me them. I'm like, you know, I don't have to tie these. I really, just really don't know how. So years go by, my wife found them and she was like, she found a video on um, Facebook where they were creating bow ties from regular ties. And she tried that with my ties and was like, hey, I can make a bow tie. And I was like, wait a minute, you're not going to be able to tie no bow tie before me. Like, that's not going to happen. You know, okay, those are my bow ties. I'm going to tie my own bow tie. So I, I got the bow ties out and I was looking at videos and we both were looking at videos. It was almost like a challenge. Like she kind of challenged me to get her bow tie before me. So she is just in the mirror, just going nuts with it. And then she just ended up saying, I got it. And I was like, wait a minute, this can't happen. You can't be tying no ties before me. So I need to do this. I am a man. Again, see that whole thing, you know, where, where men just feel like they're so challenged and in order for it to be, you know, a man, I got to know how to do it first. This was my frame of mind back then. This is what I wanted. I needed to do this before her. And it was upsetting me that I didn't. It took me hours. I'm talking about to figure this out. So we're both in there. And then when we both got it, it kind of was like we got it both at the same time. Um, she did hers and then I did mine. And we're like taking a picture together like, yeah, feeling accomplished. It was a great feeling to finally get that thing done. But now I take um, I, I take gratitude in it. And it feels it feels good to be able to tie a bow tie. Um, you know, it's, it's nothing like special. It's nothing that's going to make you more of a man or whatever. But you know something? It's, it's a it's a classy feeling. So I'm able to, again, dress up and dress down however I want, add a little bit of flair to my dress attire because I'm no longer 20, so I'm not going to be out here rocking, you know, any type of street gear. Um, not very often anyway. I still do that. I'm from New York, so I make sure I do it sometimes. But the majority of the time, you're going to find me in some type of a, a polo button down or something like that just because, you know, I feel as though it's more refined and I am of age. So I kind of want to make sure I play on that, um, show my... my maturity in my uh you know my, my sexiness you know what i'm saying so thank you so much guys for, for tuning in um again if you need any other you know help or if you have any questions about it drop it in the comments i'll be glad to to help you along with that but i hope you enjoyed the video later guys